types of water. The correct view is that water is divided into two types only. Tahur, water which purifies, and Najis, impure. 1. All water that falls from the sky or springs from the earth is Tahur, purifying, which purifies from Hadith, ritual impurities, and al khabath physical impurities, even if its colors, taste, or smell changes due to something Tahir, pure. As the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, in the meaning of which, water is pure and nothing can make it impure, narrated by the authors of the Sunan, and it is Sahih, authentic. 2. However, if one of its characteristics change its taste, color, or smell by a najasa, a physical impurity, then it is najas, impure, and must be avoided. The default state concerning everything is that it is pure and permissible. Therefore, if... 1. A Muslim doubts the pure impurity of some water, a garment, or a particular area, or anything else, then it is tahir, pure. 2. Or if he is certain of it, the purity, but doubts concerning hadith, state of ritual impurity, then it is tahir, pure. This is because he وسلم, said about the one who thinks that he has passed wind during his salah, in the meaning of which he should not leave until he hears a sound or perceives a smell agreed upon. In addition, this is supported by unanimous principle in fiqh, which says certainty is not removed by doubt. This means that something that is established with certainty cannot be removed except by certainty, and it is not removed by whatever falls below that which is doubt or imagination. The Prophet wasallam said about the sea, in the meaning of which it is water is pure, and its dead is permissible to eat, narrated by Al-Bukhari.